It doesn't. They will. You might have a manager tell you to do to go out there and just scope all day and scope all day and scope all day and then take a day and write them up and scope all day for two or three days and then write them up. Don't listen to that person. This is Adjuster TV. Adjusters first. Adjuster TV is brought to you by Kaplik. Learn all about E&O and other insurance for adjusters at cplic.net slash adjuster TV. Because they are under a lot of pressure for, for claims to be get, to get contacted and looked at so that the insurance company stays out of hot water with the state as far as the, the rules about you know contacts and inspections and all that kind of stuff. Right. right? That doesn't have to be you. You do what's going to keep you on that storm and you're going to build up speed. If you're brand new to this, the reason why you want to only scope what you can reasonably and realistically close that same day are the following. Number one, you're going to get calibrated, right? So you go out, your first claim is at nine o'clock in the morning on Monday. And you go out, you take however long it takes to scope that thing. You do a handwritten scope. You write, you take scope notes, you draw your diagrams, you get all your measurements, all that stuff, right? Like you said, take that to the help room. If it's early in the storm, you're going to be the only person in there, probably, right? And you're going to get all the help to close that claim. That builds confidence, right? It builds momentum for you because you're like, all right, I've seen the process through one time, right? I've walked through every step, gone through ECS or Navigator or whatever it is, right? It's the carrier's thing. And then that file goes through file review and file review might kick it back and say, hey, listen, you forgot this photo or you forgot to do this or that, or actually we need to make this note this or depreciate that or whatever. You get calibrated on the little stupid mistakes, right? With one claim, not one claim. 37. Like if you went and scoped a whole bunch for three or four days or five days, and then you sat in your hotel room in your underwear and wrote them up for three or four days or went home, right? You're calibrated. Um, you're going to get new claims a lot faster because you're closing claims, right? Because every day that you go out and scope, whether it's one or four or five or six later in the your first storm, maybe those claims are closed by the end of that day. That's your speed limit is to say, well, what can I close by the end of the day, right? Um, you're going to get paid sooner because every time you turn in the, the file, the invoice goes in with it. File review might kick it back, but it's in the pipeline. You've got 24 hours to do your corrections, do the corrections, send it back up. It's going on your next paycheck, right? Your, your very next paycheck, hopefully. So the thing I'll tell you to do, if you're at the house and uh, you know you don't have to write it up on site, I encourage people to do it. That's how my very first storm, that's how I was taught to do it. The, the insurance company was huge on table, they call tabletop or first contact settlement, right? First inspection settlement where you handed the homeowner a check, right? We had draft authority. Um, but don't, like you, like, like you just said, you're, even though you're like, I'm totally going to remember this, you're not going to remember it at all because time is different on cat, right? It'll, you'll go three days and it'll feel like a month, right? And then you'll do three weeks and it'll feel like a year. And you're going to look back and all the houses are all going to blur together, Right. Homeowner may have been there, may not have been there. They all look, everybody looks the same and all the houses look the same and everything's starting, you're, you know, and plus you're, fil you're having a bunch of drive time in there. You're staying up till all hours. No matter what you do, your first storm, you're going to be up all night. I mean, it's just a fact, right? Coming up on Adjuster TV. 